Oh hi, thanks for watching my video. So today we are going to be doing a little bit of collecting. I have my sim here, her name is Nadine, and she's just recently moved into Tomerang. Like literally just moved in, she's just come out of Cass. She lives with this random guy, uh, I think his name's Addy. I did not make him, I just moved in so that I could keep the furniture and not have to refurnish this place. But one of the new collectibles that was introduced with the Full Rent expansion pack was the tassels. And so far, I have yet to collect them all. So that's what we're doing today. Today we're going to try and collect all ten, so each tassel is a different colour. Although I think oh. it's possible to get like multiple ones, so hopefully we get lucky and we can collect all ten colours. And once we have collected them all, we'll be able to trade it in for, I think it's at like a tassel top? No, it is quite late, it's 10pm, but I think it's probably a good time to go to the night market. So we'll just head up here, we'll go to the park and then wander around. As far as I'm aware, the tassels can be collected by buying them at the night market. They can also be dug up from piles of sand. I think there is another way to get them as well, but I can't remember... I can't remember exactly what the other way to get them was. I think it was, um, like, breaking in to some of the rabbit holes. Like, if we broke into the... If we broke into the tiger sanctuary. So we're gonna go here, we'll purchase goods. I'm pretty sure all the other stands here is just food and drink, isn't it? Food drink yeah okay so i think this is the only stand where i can buy some possible tassels so this is where we'll start our collection and then tonight maybe we'll wander over to the tiger sanctuary and see if we can break in okay we already have one light green tassel pink tassel okay okay so we've got two that's two out of ten. Eight more to go okay sweet i think we're getting a little bit tired but that's fine i think we still have time to go and break into the tiger sanctuary i might just go back to my home lot and then i can just wander over here it is sneak into sanctuary and then maybe what we'll do yeah our needs are pretty good we just want to get some sleep so once we've finished sneaking in hopefully we find a tassel then tomorrow we'll head to the beach and see if we can dig up some sand piles Maybe we'll explore the cave. I don't know if you can get tassels from there, but we can find out. God, this is a long walk. Sneaking through the lobby, Nadine sees an employee's only room to the far right. That must be where they keep the good snacks. Tiptoeing towards the door, the sound of approaching footsteps echoes off the stone and tile. Someone's coming! She better find a way to avoid getting caught. Mm, I'm gonna say sneak for the employee room. Nadine's heart was pounding. But the guard strolled by, thankfully not even bothering to look in this room. Feeling proud of herself, she looked around and spotted some very tasty snacks. Grabbing as many as her arms could carry, Nadine decided it was time to skedaddle with these ill-gotten goods. She was lucky enough to dodge the guard once, but a second run-in best be avoided. Well, I don't know. I, I didn't want snacks, though. I wanted a tassel. I might send you back in. Okay. Ah, oh, we can't sneak back in. Fuck's sake, you didn't even get a tassel, did you? No, you just got... Some animal crackers. God damn, Nadine. Okay, it's a new day. We've had a good night's sleep. So I'm thinking, obviously we want to we wanna go to the beach. And it's probably worth going to the night market again. Because they might have some more tassels on offer. So if we come to the beach and maybe get dressed. I'm going to have you explore the cave. And then when you get back, how many sand piles are there? Just two? Maybe we'll find a tassel in the sand pile. Locals have always ventured into Beard Beard Cove to soak in both the beauty and the history along the eastern wall. Nadine finds cave carvings and drawings all splayed out. It tells a tale of war and triumph, if you're keen enough to decipher it. Um, maybe admire from a safe distance? There's so much time that Nadine can spend staring at a cave art before it all, before it all starts to just look like rocks. Okay. Are you saying we didn't get a tassel? Is that what you're saying? I'm gonna go explore again after we dig these sand piles. Do we find anything there? <gasps> a yellow tassel! I don't think I had a yellow one. Oh, now I have two. Ah, oh, found two yellow tassels in those two sand piles. Well, at least we've got three. Seven more to go now. Um, let's continue forward across the slippery rocks. I've had this pop up before and it didn't bode well for me. Nadine carefully made her way across the rocks, choosing the safest looking spots to step down and sometimes downright crawling, but she did it. 
She continues forward, taking in all the cave's beauty. Eventually, after mis- many twists and turns, she finds herself outside again, grateful to not have to backtrack over the wet rocks. Oh, okay. But will we come back with a tassel? No, we will not. Okay, fine, fine. We'll head down to the night market. Oh, it's only open until six. It's only open at six. Oh, I see. Well, I'm pretty sure that if I, uh... If I complete this aspiration, I think it increases my chances of finding tassels. So I'm going to go to the botanical gardens. I did this aspiration when I did my initial playthrough, but I didn't get very far in it. So maybe I'll try a bit harder this time. So first thing, leave fruit or incense at a spirit house. See, it kind of annoys me that I have to place this here and build and buy. Considering there's like nothing to do in the botanical gardens, you would have thought this would have been on this lot by default. Okay, now I will go to the bar. I'll go and meet some other Sims. Hopefully one of them has the child of the village personality trait. Not really much else I can do to collect tassels. During the day, it seems. Although I might be able to collect them just from visiting the Tiger Sanctuary, I don't know. Uh, Tomorani introduction. Congrats to the bartender, looks like she has just graduated today. Also gonna come and use a squat toilet. Another Tomorani introduction, this sim might have that trait. I'm not really looking to get too much out of this aspiration, I just kind of want to power through it to increase my chances of finding tassels. So I guess we're going to end up doing a bit of a speed run here, but that's fine by me. Uh, I'm going to... did I already introduce myself to you? I guess I did. Okay, well in that case I'm going to come use the toilet again. Could this sim have that trait? Maybe? I think in order for me to meet someone with that trait I'm just going to have to go around to all of the locals, aren't I? Oh, there we go! She did have the child of the village Jasper personality trait. Okay, great. Okay, well, let's go use a squat toilet. I might just use it twice in a row. Okay, perfect. First milestone complete. Okay, the next are just about using the pressure cooker and buying stuff from the night market. So what I might do now is I might head over to the tiger sanctuary and see if maybe a day visit might help me get some tassels pop back home and then that way I can buy myself a slow cooker or a pressure cooker once I've been there. Okay, visit the sanctuary. All right, go on girl, you have fun. So what should we do? Let's ask about current conservation efforts. We've had some pretty famous supporters like Judith Ward as she starred in Tiger Talks. The experience she had on set left her feeling fiercely philanthropic. That's a lovely plaque, there's a lovely plaque somewhere thanking her for her donations. Still no tassel though. What if I visit again? Maybe maybe you can only get a tassel from sneaking in. Okay, well, no luck at the Tiger Sanctuary, but that's fine. I'm going to do a bit of cooking. I will cook, well, I need to cook three lots of Tomorani cuisine anyway, so I may as well just cook all three dishes. And then by the time we're done, the night market will be open. How's our food coming along? Okay, empty. Oh, it's a shame we can't just take out, like, a full plate. We're wasting so much food. Okay, cook this one now. Oh, what if I just got two pressure cookers? That would be a pretty easy solution, wouldn't it? Oh, and we achieved new skill day as well. Oh, congratulations. You've had a better life in these 20 minutes than most of my sims ever get. In hours worth of gameplay, Nadine. Okay, cook Tomorani cuisine. Done. Let's head over to the night market and we'll pick up a couple of things. Maybe even some tassels. Oh, hello officer. Okay, so we need to buy food. So I'll just order something from here, tofu stir fry. And then we'll also buy a shirt, maybe a striped, striped shirt. And then also we'll purchase goods and see if we can maybe get some more tassels. Hey, second milestone complete. I've already done the unique tassels one. I guess I only needed three. Ah, oh, still only the same green and pink tassel. That is not what I wanted. Okay, well I am on the last page now of my aspiration, which is making me think that probably I'll be able to get this Tomorang expert trait fairly quickly. Sims with this trait are better at finding tassels. Well, with that in mind, I don't think there's anything else here for me at the night market. I might try sneaking into the Tiger Sanctuary again. I don't know if it would really count sneaking in, but we'll see. I can at least view the statue, so I can cross that one off. 
sneak into sanctuary and then we may as well come and view this statue oh no this time i tried ha sneaking into the trash can and i think i got caught ah oh, still still no tassel i am viewing the statue though and it doesn't seem to be crossing off oh there we go perfect well i know it's late but is it too late to go and explore the cave i do have some more sand piles here so i let's dig these up and then we'll go explore the cave again are there any more like little hidden sand piles that I haven't tried digging yet? Is it really just only two? I found a ducky. Okay, well, fine. We'll just explore the cave after we finish digging this sand pile. Oh, turquoise tassel. Yes. Four out of ten. Only six to go. Okay, go and explore the cave. Maybe, just maybe, we'll find another tassel in there. Probably not, but we have to remain hopeful, Nadine. Oh, I can explore the passageway. That seems to be my only option, so I'm going to do that. I don't think it's going to take me to a hidden world. Keep going. I'm running out of... I I'm not getting any options. I just have to... Okay, now I have two. Exiting the tight enclosure, Nadine is encompassed by a large cave with light streaming through a small opening in the rocks above. It's a little oasis all to herself. Staying put and soaking in the beauty is certainly an option, however a large stack of rocks resembling a stairway of sort catches her eye. Fair warning, cave rocks tend to make excellent homes for tiny creatures. Um, well, let's just stay put then. Enjoy the oasis. Okay, maybe time to leave. So, no tassel. Okay, well then let's just go home. I'm still fairly confident once we've explored the Tiger Sanctuary tomorrow, I reckon we'll have a much easier time finding tassels. Okay, day two of trying to collect all the tassels. So we're going to start with the Animal Sanctuary. Oh wait, what time does it open? Nadine is temporarily banned from the sanctuary. Oh no. Come back in a day or two. Okay, I can't have that. Is there a way for me to remove the ban? <laughs> There must be. There must be a way. Okay, so turns out there isn't a way to remove my ban. <laughs> so I've just kind of had to suck it up and play through a few days. I think I'm still banned, uh, but now my apartment is cursed. Oh, there's the cursed book. So all I have to do, destroy the cursed book or mail it away. I'm just going to mail it away. Pass the curse on. Send it to my landlord. Or actually, no. Send it to those fat cats at the tiger sanctuary for banning me. Okay, curse, sorted. And the landlord, the property owner, sent me 57 simoleons for helping to address the issue. Oh, great, I can solve my own, own problems. Strong, independent woman. Okay, well then, let's just go back to sleep. I'm, so my plan is, I was still banned all day yesterday, so Monday. I'm hoping that by Wednesday, I'll be unbanned, because that will be two full days of being banned from this fucking sanctuary. And I've already been there. I only want to go there to complete this aspiration. Okay, it is now Wednesday, two days after I was banned. Please tell me I can go into the Tiger Sanctuary now. Two days is long enough. I've learned from my mistakes. I've accepted my punishment. Oh, finally, okay, I can visit the sanctuary now. Okay, and that will cross off this aspiration and hopefully increase our chances of finding some tassels. Finally. Milestone complete, okay. Aspiration complete. All right, so I should now have... Tomerang expert. Okay, okay. So if I visit the Tiger Sanctuary, am I going to have any luck now? And then I'm also going to also going to wander over to the beach. I don't think I got a tassel that way. Okay, let's pop over here. So we should technically have better luck when digging through sand piles now. We found Belladonna Cove. Okay, well that was a marble. Just give me a rare tassel. A tuk-tuk goose. Ugh, okay. Go explore the cave. I wonder if there are any more sand piles in like this little walkway area. This area right here, is there just nothing here? In fact, you know what? There are sand piles at the other beach, so I could have looked there too. Mm, I don't see any sand piles over here. Oh, there's one right here, so I'll dig that sand pile. Oh, and this one, okay. Found a couple more. I'm guessing the same pop-ups that I did before, so this time I think I've found the little oasis place. Okay, so this time, last time I stayed put, this time I'm going to make the climb. And I found an orange tassel, which... Did I already have that? No, I've got five now. Okay, beautiful. All right, that's better. Much better. It's coming up Millhouse now. So let's go dig up some sand piles, and then we're going to swim to the other beach and see if there are any sand piles over there. Let me just check while you do that that there aren't any other sand piles I've missed. Oh, I found a magenta tassel. Okay, very nice. So we're on six tassels now. I found another green one. Oh, 
Seven tassels, That because that wasn't a light green tassel, it was just a normal green one. Okay, much better, much better. I see there's another sand pile here, so I'm going to dig this one. So far, though, absolutely no tassels obtained. Oh, wait, no, that was a flat-out lie. I was about to say no tassels obtained by using the cave, but that's where we got the orange tassel. What a difference that trait makes, though, from completing the aspiration. We've got three different coloured ta tassels in one day. I wonder how quickly those sand piles, like, rebuild or regenerate. Was there only one sand pile over here? A turquoise tassel, which I think I already had, didn't I? Yeah. Okay, okay. Still, though, that's pretty good. Um, you know, I actually really don't have anything else to do with my day, so I'm kind of tempted to just go back to the cave. I may as well. That way there's at least a slight chance that I'll get another tassel, and I'll just do this until the night market comes up again. Oh, I just got a blue tassel! from trying to decipher the drawings on the wall from the carvings. So does that mean I now have eight? Yeah, eight out of ten, only two more to get. Oh, okay, I'm gonna explore the cave again. So I think I'm getting the passageway pop-ups again. Um, so when I stayed put, nothing happened. When I made the climb, I got an orange tassel. So I'm gonna make the climb again and see. Okay, I got another blue tassel, okay. Cool, cool. So it's not going to be an orange tassel every time, that's good to know. So if I do that again, I might find a different colour. Another blue tassel. Maybe it's just a set colour every day, because I just keep getting blue ones. Oh shit, I just got a red tassel from deciphering the carvings again. Oh wow, 9 out of 10 tassels, okay. Alright, we're getting close. We're getting real close. I'm going to explore it one more time, and then I'm going to head to the night market. Yeah, I got another red tassel. Okay, fine, fine. Let's go see what the night market has to offer, if anything. And also, seeing as I don't need to not be banned from the animal sanctuary again, if I don't find the tassel I need from here, I'm gonna sneak into the sanctuary again. Okay, light green, pink. Oh, again, again doesn't have the tassel I need. All right, let's go sneak into the animal sanctuary then. Sneak in. Okay, so this time we're not gonna hide in the trash can because that's what got us banned last time. So, sneak in the employee room. Oh no, you're temporarily banned. Oh, fuck's sake. Okay, fine, doesn't matter. I got the trait I needed anyway. Okay, it's a new day once again, so we are gonna go to the beach. I think that's probably our best bet now of finding that last tassel. So I'm gonna come dig this sand pile. <gasps> Collection complete! We've got them all! Every tassel has been found! What was the last one then? The purple tassel. Let me just take a look then at all of my tassels, my tassel collection. Beautiful. I kind of like them as decor, but I do want to see this tassel top in action. So if I go to combine tassels, Tomorani tassel shirt unlocked. Okay, let's take a look. Here it is! Here's the tassel top in whatever colour you like. Quite like the purple and the pink. I think we'll go for this one. You know, I actually kind of preferred just having the tassels as decor. But there we go. We started this video with a challenge and now we've completed that challenge. And I think I might put my other tassels up just as like decor around the house. So on that note, I think I'm gonna end this video here. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe. You know I love it when you do that. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.